Come, let's learn science. Our today's topic. Solute versus solvent. What is the difference between solutes and solvents? Well, firstly, solute is the substance that is dissolved by another substance to form a solution. Solvent is a substance that dissolves the particles of the solute in a solution. For example, consider sugar and water. We add sugar to water to form a solution. So, sugar is the solute and water is the solvent because water dissolves the sugar particles. Secondly, the quantity of solute is less than the solvent in a solution, whereas the quantity of solvent is more than the solute in a solution. For example, we add 10 grams of sugar to 100 grams of water. So, the quantity of water, solvent is more than that of the sugar, which is the solute. Thirdly, solute might exist in solid, liquid, or gaseous state, while solvents exist mostly in liquid state. But, in rare cases, the solvent may exist in solid or gaseous state. For example, sugar exists in solid state and water exists in liquid state. Fourthly, solutes have higher boiling points than solvents, while solvents generally have lower boiling points than solutes. For example, the boiling point of water is 100 degrees Celsius, while the boiling point of sugar is 102 degrees Celsius. Fifthly, heat is transferred to the solute, while, in a solution, heat is transferred from the solvent. For example, in sugar water solution, we know that sugar is the solute and water is the solvent. Heat will transfer from the water to the sugar. So, we therefore say that heat is transferred from solvent to the solute in a solution. So far, you have seen five differences between solute and solvent. Now, let us see some examples of solute and solvent for better understanding. Well, consider example 1, soda. In this solution, carbon dioxide is the solute and water is the solvent. Here, solute is in the gaseous state and solvent is in the liquid state. Example 2, salt water. Here, salt is the solute and water is the solvent. Here, solute is in solid state and solvent is in liquid state. Example 3, coffee. In this solution, coffee powder is the solute and milk is the solvent. Here, solute is in the solid state and solvent is in the liquid state. Example 4, consider air. In this solution, oxygen is dissolved in nitrogen gas. So, oxygen is the solute and nitrogen is the solvent. Here, solute and solvent both are in the gaseous state. Thanks for watching. Subscribe my channel and hit the like button.